Hey everybody, welcome back to Zero Time Dilemma, part three. We're here, <laughs> we're ready to do this. You almost made it without laughing. You almost made it. <laughs> we just kind of, we looked like we were, we both looked like we were on death's door. <laughs> <laughs> we were looking at the camera, and so we decided to do a funny intro. This chair is so comfy, it's hard not to just be like... It's okay, I'm going to look over at some point during the video, and I guarantee you'll be like... Yes. <laughs> Everyone get ready for me to just be like uh, Oh <laughs> actually let's go. let's go over here. Okay, so um in the last video we did the decontamination room mm -hmm. with the three different teams. Mm -hmm. And this why is this microphone so like I like I trying to move it is like Was it too loose? No, it's too tight. <gasps> too tight. That sounded really too tight. It's it's so tight I can't untighten it. Okay, you know what? Whatever. I'll just deal with it. All right. That's what he said. So, what would you like to do? We have we have a number of different um, scenarios we can do. We can do a Connie with a chainsaw. I I we feel like do... we've got to do the chainsaw one. We we've talked about it in the last what two videos? Sure. Because what the, the what the heck night. is going on here? Yeah. Oh my, this is actually a long one. Ooh. We Dude. might get we might get stopped actually cuz like okay, so for example, we did this one, right? Uh-huh. But this was this was the scene tree right here. Yeah, which Ooh. we didn't go the other way. Wait, why didn't we do that? I don't know. We can do it if you want to. No, we don't have to do it. You want to do it? Obviously not. You do it, I can do it. Or do we want to see what's up with this chainsaw? Yeah. Okay. We need to, we need to do the chainsaw. I'm going to call this the break stuff scene. Okay, great. She doesn't get the reference. Because I haven't seen it yet. No. Limp Biscuits break stuff. Oh. Oh, we know a pack of chainsaw. What's getting your ass raw? <laughs> You've heard it before. I've shown her that song before. I believe you. All right, she's back on death's door. Let's go ahead and just let's go ahead and move on. You could have done like Texas Chainsaw Massacre reference, or none of those are as relevant. I feel like it's more. I don't relevant. think you understand how culturally impactful "Break Stuff" by Limp Bizkit is. Okay, we have talked about my poor musical education. All right. Well, we're watching it after this. We're watching it. I'm gonna I'm gonna clockwork orange you to the chair, oh and you're you're gonna be forced to watch break stuff by Olympus. As long as I can be in this chair, that's fine. No, it'd be a wooden chair, no. folding chair for you. No, <laughs> so you can't just fall asleep. <laughs> <laughs> All right, no, sorry. Uh, yeah, we are here to do a playthrough. Um, so here we go. Jump. Chainsaw. What what Something is this? about our asses. Suspicion. <gasps> What's going on? How sus. <laughs> this is the pantry. <laughs> oh, Sorry. hey, Carlos, where's Junpei? This is no the idea. pantry. <laughs> he was already gone when I woke up. Wait, Junpei's not there? What? <sighs> it's locked. Wait. Did Junpei do this? You think he woke up first and then locked us in? It's been a long time since you've seen each other, right? Maybe now he's Zero's accomplice. That's not possible. The Junpei I know would never do something like that to us. Sorry. No, Y'all probably have to get him it's out of something. just one of the possibilities. Junpei. You know, this has been on my mind for a while. But what exactly is he to you, Akane? It's hard to believe that you two just knew each other in grade school. Junpei, he's very... Yes, he's very important to me. All my life, I've never really had many friends to call my own. That's surprising. Yeah. I would have taken important. you as the type guys yeah. and girls all fawn over in Japan. Oh, you're very kind. Thank you. But that's not exactly... Junpei always said... I was a girl who always said what shouldn't be said. I never found myself bullied or anything. 
but it still seemed as if people considered me something of an odd girl. Junpei was different. He told me he'd rush to my aid whenever I was troubled. Once, when we were young, <laughs> I was crying over something, and he faced the enemy alone. Oh yeah, the bunny he thing? He sounds or? like he's a comic book hero. The bunny yes. thing? I forgot all to about that. To me, he that. is, at the very least. Yeah. But this past year has completely changed him. Seems to me like he's the exact opposite now. If it was because of me somehow, then this time I need to rush to his aid. Junpei got red That's pills. That's what I decided anyway. <laughs> yeah. You really like Junpei, don't you? He discovered Andrew Tate. What in the world are you saying, <laughs> oh, Carlos? No. I'm out of my depth when it comes to romance. My co-workers do always come to me with their stories. <laughs> Look at her. <laughs> so I can tell. Just by looking. I can tell if someone's in love. Does that God. mean there isn't anyone like that for you? That important? There is. I love my little sister very much. That's nice. Just a sunshine on my life. A different kind oh, of love. Oh, so a sister complex. Ha ha. You're horrible. Consider it payback for earlier. Now then. This conversation's so weird. Nothing will come from just sitting yeah. around here. How about we find a way out? Right. There's some stuff I that gets lost in translation. Yeah. As soon as you can. <laughs> oh, Carlos! <laughs> I think that's one of the things about anime that's so jarring to me, is mm -hmm. that, like, it's not how, like, I guess Americans speak, you know? We're but, doing a, we're doing a room. <gasps> we're doing our first room! Yeah. Oh, I'm excited! Not to cut off your anime slander, but... Oh right. Well, it, I'm obviously doing it in the wrong place anyway. So yeah, this is not this is not going to be the receptive audience to that. Touche. Sorry, everyone. Just kidding. There are they're already they're already typing up essays as we speak. <laughs> what the fuck? What, what did you just say about anime? Yeah. Okay. Sorry. Uh, so this is interesting. We get instead of like clicking to different perspectives, we get a full 360 degree view. I'm not I'm not sure if I. I like it. That from VLR. Oh, we get to voice act. Get ready. <gasps> okay. okay. Do I need to be closer to the mic? No, it's okay. You could just <laughs> you can be on death's door while you voice act. That's fine. I'm so it's, <laughs> it's hard <laughs> to sit up. I'm, just I'm gonna make you wear a watermelon one of these days, like all those TikTok oh, videos no, I keep seeing. Don't do it. No. With the watermelon uh, and the melon boobs, and then make you lay let's down. Let's see how he likes up. it. Oh, it's hard to do stuff, isn't it? And then, and then I go. I suffer. And then I go. Yeah, it's hard. Can I take it off now? I'll make you wear it for a week. <laughs> no, how are you gonna make me do that? Every time you try start to take it off, I'm gonna wrap you up real tight. <laughs> <laughs> I'll always have Saran wrap with me. You're gonna be like a little wrap ninja. Yeah, I'll start duct taping it. Yeah. She'll so suddenly have energy then, I guess. Well, if I can get it on you in the first place, then it'll be easier to catch you. Oh, I see. <laughs> uh, okay. Let's see. I haven't actually really been paying attention to Carlos's voice, but... There's nothing we can use here. Oh, okay. Well, that was... That was easy. Hmm. Oh, what the... Oh, you huh? have two cursors? What the... What, what? am I doing? I guess, I guess it's like to keep track of things, like to take notes. Clear this page's notes. Oh. Oh. Okay, so Ooh. like, let's look at that machine thing. Machine thing. This thing? Or this thing, this thing. I was thinking of that thing. Okay, um. Is the power seems to be off on this machine. Doesn't the hole in this panel look like a gingerbread man? I wonder what it could be. So I saw a poster that talked about gelatin. Mm. Is, Is that, that hole really that fascinating? I thought it was her, sorry. Oh, well, I was just remembering how much fun I had baking as a child. Did you bake heart-shaped cookies full of love for your darling Junpei? Oh, Carlos, would you please stop teasing me? The man-shaped hole in the on-off markers. What could this be? Hmm. Well, and there's different. There's like a there's like a color slider here. Yeah. Okay. So there's a poster behind us that talks about gelatin. 
Yes. A recipe for gelatin. It's nice of them to draw it out, but it's kind of vague. If there's a recipe, then there's probably ingredients too. You should make some and give it to Junpei when we see him. I made it just for you. No, I'm not bold enough to say something like that. That's too bad. A girl like you saying that would definitely capture his heart. <coughs> My God. So, step I love one. You, Junpei. <laughs> Sorry. Pay attention to the puzzle. Girls yes. and their romance. Oh my god. Uh, All right, so we need okay, water. Okay, so we need water. It says needs to be chilled. So cold water. Step two, put in the powder into the chilled water. And then Step three, microwave it. put it in the... Yeah, microwave, I guess. It's probably like a little... And then, and then you slap it down and it's gelatin. <laughs> gelatin is served. Slap it. I like oh. that it's headless. That's really weird. I want some jello. I know. We have some. I know, but we can't have any. We can't have any. <gasps> ah! This is... A left arm. Pretty sure it's fake. Uh, I hope so. Damn, no use. It's locked on the wrist. There's a spot for a key. Maybe there's one around here somewhere? Is it in the arm? Are we playing saw all of a sudden? All of a sudden? <gasps> Left leg. Is Zero trying to scare us? Oh, it's... Powder to make gelatin. Okay. Gelatin powder, oh. right? This leg looks so real. Disgusting. What the hell, Zero? Putting something like that in here. So, if it's a left leg and a left arm, could this be in reference to brother's brother left? It could be. Huh? What's this? It's round. Maybe it's a knob for a machine? Uh, she's talking about this thing, I guess. Yeah. And the bunch of potatoes. A round part. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's There's like machine. a T shape here, too. For the machine! A round yellow part. If you look closely, you can see a tiny triangle. Maybe it's a machine part. Maybe. Oh, she's talking about the... Oh, I was like, a T? Was... You're right. Gelatin powder is mostly for baking. But it has uses in everyday cooking, too. Oh, Carlos, I didn't know you liked to cook. My mom's the one. I've seen her use it in a stew or pasta sometimes. Gelatin? I don't know. I don't know. What a nice mother. I'm a little jealous. A little jealous, get it? <laughs> oh, jelly. Jelly, gelatin. It was a long time ago, <laughs> but the memory is still so clear in my head. Okay. So, did Akane not have a nice mother? Let's see, left door, right door. Oh, oh, Carlos! The potatoes are cut up into round pieces. You're right. Time to fire up the grill and... Chow down. On second thought, I don't feel much like eating while we're stuck here. I mean, I probably should eat eventually. L door, R door. R door. Okay. Do the potatoes hold any significance? What's this over here? Is that anything? I wonder if it's talking about the cabinet doors. Oh! Gah, what is this? Is this a torso? Huh? This is... It says iodine solution. Iodine solution in a bottle. Iodine solution in a bottle, That's not baby. what she says. That's not what she says. <laughs> come on, this come is, on. You're supposed to read what on. she says. You're supposed to read what she says. Look what she says. Look what she says. Read what she says. Iodine solution in a bottle, she baby. Read <laughs> what she says. <laughs> no. Okay, now I will know that you're not pointing at it anymore. Stop pointing at it and I'll read it. I'm pointing at it. Read it. <laughs> I remember... <ba> <laughs> <laughs> I remember being told as a kid to never put any of it in my mouth. And the more you're told not to, the more you want to do it. Did you try it? Oh my god. I was curious, but I knew a boy who did it and he got severely reprimanded as a result. Let me guess. Junpei. Man, that guy. 
Uh, I love how much he hates Junpei. He doesn't hate Junpei. He's he just like doesn't like him. No, he's like he's just shaking his head like that guy. What the heck? Carlos, is this real? Why would you think that, Akane? It's just a real. It's just a realistic fake. You're right. It couldn't be real. What if it's Junpei's torso? It looks kind of like Dwight from Dead by Daylight. Mm, mm hmm. It's a very well-made human torso. No need to look at it again. I kind of wanted to see what was on the other side, but I guess that's. I guess we're not doing that. Oh, it's kind of blocked by boxes, so I guess not. Blocked by boxes. <laughs> there are a lot of cans here. But none of them are labeled. I wonder what they hold. Water, perhaps. Like, where are we gonna get water? Okay, here we go. This opens. Oh, ah! Th this is a... A right leg. Is Zero trying to scare us with mannequin parts? There's really nothing else aside from the leg here. Let's keep looking. Okay. I like that it's with a bunch of potatoes. Yeah. Potato, potato. Okay, this seems... Yeah, let's check this out. Okay. Is that some kind of blue doll and a right arm? Oh, that's right there. I didn't even see it. I was trying to see what these said. Oh, sorry. What'd you say? Something about a glass door. Sorry. I thought I thought we were still on mine. There's an odd blue doll and what seems to be a right arm on the other side of the glass. It looks like Meek Neeks. No. Mr. Meeseeks? Meeseeks. Hi, Mr. Meeseeks. Look at me. Hmm. Yeah. Pushing these buttons should open the door. Left door, right door. Left door, right door. Can we pick up those potatoes? I don't think so. We can try. Yeah, I know. Is that annoying you? I need to rock. <laughs> don't squash my rockin'. Fine. I'll just there you go. go off to the side. Yeah, rock the baby to sleep. There, do you have enough room? Yes. All right, bye. Okay, let's. <gasps> you failed. How so there's, si there's six. It? There's six times. Six okay. times. That's why I was trying to find out. I wonder Damn if it, the it's still locked. I wonder if the pink and green make numbers to tell us what to do. Or like arrows. Ooh. Still won't open. Well, let's try again, Carlos. I want to see if it was that. It's not opening. Maybe there's a hint somewhere? Should we put the iodine solution I'm on guess the windows? Hang on. I'm guessing these buttons are how you open the lock. So we can do this one too. Okay. Here, wait. Let's go back to. It's this one, right? Uh huh. L door, R door. There's six potatoes. There's six potatoes here. Right. We had to turn. We had to press six buttons. Should I put? I was just about to say that. Me too. I literally said should. Whatever. Just go ahead. I was and about do to it. say it after you were done. Saying. God. Don't potatoes change when iodine solution is dropped on them? Yes. The starch reacts with the iodine and turns purple. <gasps> oh look! Letters appeared. Dudler. That must mean the experiment was successful. Down, up, down, left, left, right. Down, up, down, left, left, right, yeah. I have no idea. What about left door, L door, and R door? They're the, it, it's a combination for both of them. Left door, you do it this way. R door, you do it the other way. Oh, yeah. Clever. Dudler. Let's do Dudler first. Dudler. Um, so left okay. door. Pushing the buttons. Good job. I'm a genius. Huh, the letters on the potatoes were a hint after all. I never would have imagined something I learned in grade school would help me now. Oh, when the pink and the green are put together, they're gonna make something. Sure. Okay, I just wanted to make sure that it kept our settings from before. Oh, oh good. Okay. Oh. Um, let's check out Mr. Meeseeks. It's a handcuff right arm. I doubt it's real. But that's no reason to keep looking at this creepy thing. The arm can't be removed. We can take the doll. Blue doll. <laughs> Carlos, this blue doll. It feels cold. 
It was in the refrigerator. Of course it's cold. It makes me think of those cold packs you use when you have a fever. I doubt anyone will put, ever put that doll on their face, Akane. Alright, calm down, Carlos. Ooh, they're quippy, okay? This handcuff is locked. There's a keyhole here. We just need to unlock it with a key. Okay. Um, all right, look at this? that typewriter thingy. Wait, something's on the screen. Oh. Uh, oh. What are we doing? Can you like twist? Can you twist the pieces around so that they can like match each other? Like you can't rotate it. I'm trying to see like. Yeah, I would imagine we we should be able to like. Like manipulate it somehow. Yeah, but I don't know how. Hmm. Yeah, because they seem like they need to be matched up. Mm-hmm. It's like this this perp the 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 grape, the yeah. grapes. Like you turn it that way, and then you turn this that way. Right. Here, maybe is there controls? Like, is there are there is there a control screen? Here, wait here. It certainly is annoying when patterns don't align correctly. You must rotate each piece to match up with all of its adjacent ones. Click piece, rotate selected pattern, drag screen, rotate cube. Okay. They give you controller, okay. Oh, uh, that, that is what I was doing. I was doing up, down, and left, and right. Oh, but it's, uh... Oh, Q and E is rotate. Oh, uh, oh okay, so... There oh. we go. Okay. Um... Okay, so, so far... I think that th this has to be right, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like we started Absolutely. with the double grape, and that, and now we just base everything else on that. Right. Okay, well that gives us a dead end. If you go back, oh. Oh, sorry. What'd you want? Uh, keep. I want that piece down there. Yeah, this one. There you go. Okay, it's working so far. This one has to be like that, right? Uh huh. There you go. Oh, but then this has to be like that. I think that's it. Good job. We just had to figure out how what the controls were. Right. Carlos, look, the drawer. We'll see what's in it. Some kind of mold? Oh, it's the mold oh. for the gingerbread man or whatever. What is this exactly? It kind of looks like a cookie cutter, but it has a bottom. Maybe it's for gelatin? Gelatin, huh? I see. Yeah, Carlos, Ooh. wake up. All right. Still won't open. Let, well, let's try again, Carlos. Yeah, so D. Right, left, left. Right. Down, up, down. So. What was that? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so the reaction to the iodine test on the potatoes was the hint for this door. And now we get to the things inside. <gasps> Left hand doll. Left hand doll. Okay. Are these instructions? Oh, plus doll. Hmm. It shows a doll. Is it saying we should heat it up? New oh, doll manual. So oh. when it's cool, it's blue. When it's warm, it's orange. Orange. Oh. What's this? It's a bottle with water in it. A bottle of water. It's a bottle. Hmm, could be useful. Let's take it with us. It's a water bottle. If you drink it, if you drink from it, you gain superhuman powers and you can break down the door. I wish that was true. Don't try it though. It might have poison inside. I just thought it'd be nice to be the hero. But you're right. Dime right, Carlos. Oh. Listen to me. All right, calm down. Left hand Ooh. plus doll. It reads left hand plus doll. Equals. 
equals. Oh. Left hand plus doll, huh? Yeah, and hand is lowercase. So I'm thinking it's uh, the left hand we found in the that's hooked up in the cabinet. This one? No. That's the right hand. That's the right hand. Yeah, the left hand's in the cabinet right there. So we have to put that. The handcuff isn't coming off. We need to find the key for it. Maybe the key is inside the doll. It could be. If we if we warm it up. Mm-hmm. The power's off, right. So we need to power it up. Let's try putting all this stuff with it. All the stuff with it. Like the dial, the tin. We need to chill the water. Oh, the, chi the water's already chilled. It should be, yeah. Um. Okay, mold with water. Now we add the powder to the water. Mm hmm And now... We should put that on the machine with the dial. But it needs to be gelatin, right? Let's just see what happens if we try to put it here. Uh, I mean, I'll try. Hey, Carlos, do you think we could put something in this hole? Yeah, you're right. What do we have that might fit? I mean, I... How do I use it? Maybe it's the I, dial that has to go first. I put some gelatin powder into the mold with water. Good job. Now all we need to do is cool it, and then we'll have so made some gelatin. Oh, we cool it. So it's like a microwave, but like cooling? This kind of feels like I'm on a cooking show. We'll call it Zero Time for Cooking with Carlos and Akane. Zero time. Haha. <laughs> yeah. Funny. Oh, Ooh. okay. So we need to cool it. I thought we needed to... Uh... You know what? That that makes sense, because that's how you actually make jello. Yeah. Now I'm asking about how do you how do you use the item? Right. Um like So remember how the dial has the little T that we saw in the mold? Yeah. You could try putting that in and see if that does anything. I'm 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 just trying to cool the the gelatin though. Didn't the poster show to put it in the oh. um microwave looking thing? Hang on. Uh, touch the item icon in the top left to open the item screen. Examining locations while holding an item will use it on the area selected. Oh. Okay, so we've already got it. Yeah. Uh, let's let's look at the thing again. I guess. Oh. So the the microwave can make things cold or hot. I guess so, yeah. But it's powered off. What about this drawer? Hey, Carlos, this part looks sort of like a drawer. But, gah, no, can't open it without a handle. Do we have a handle? So I guess we have to figure out how to power on the machine first. I think maybe, maybe that's how we do it, is the drawer. Because, here, let me. Oh. Yes, the machine powered on. This depression in the panel must be the power switch. Let's see if we can use it. Well, now the power's on, but what's with the rest of this hole? I don't know. Maybe our hand goes in it? Nothing's happening. Just what is this for? Okay, I get it. I... Is there anything? It's like, oh my god. No point to putting it in as it is now. So we put it in the top box first. Oh, okay. We can use this to heat or cool items. Uh, cool. Let's cool this down. Oh, it turned solid. Now we have gelatin. That was really fast. Uh, 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 oh, it's see-through. That's cute. Okay, and we can warm up the uh, uh, doll, too. This depression. Maybe we put... Okay. Sorry. I... It's fine. Sorry. You can... I don't know what she said. Maybe we can put the gelatin in it. Okay. Just go on. It's fine. 
She makes a big fuss. I didn't. You were the one pointing and demanding me to read, and then you're suddenly like, click, 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 click. Interesting. Whoa. Yeah. Someone you is heard me. Popping off right now. Mm -hmm. Because I'm right. Huh? I heard a sound from below the machine. <gasps> oh, look! The drawer at the bottom opened. <sighs> Trying to distract us. Oh. Huh? Hey, that's a. A key! I wonder what that's for. Huh. Small key. I wonder what it's for. A key. Akane? It's pretty small. What is it for? I don't know. Let's try using it with every keyhole we find. Oh my god. Wait, first, first, I want to go ahead. Before we do that, I want to warm this up. Um. Okay. Okay, warm. How about we try warming it up? And we can cool it down or warm it up. Look at that. The color turned a pale pink. He'd been trapped in that refrigerator so long that his skin turned blue. I feel kind of bad for this little guy now. Oh. The doll turned pale. The number 1234 is on its stomach. Look close. I thought it was ketchup, but it looks like it was written with blood. Ketchup? Really? You have to admit that it'd be pretty funny. Zero using ketchup to write this out? One, two, three, four. How would that be pretty funny? Because we would think that it was not ketchup. I don't know. <laughs> Maybe this is the key for the handcuff. Yes, the arm has been freed. Is Seven. it five two nine or six? Five two. Six. It would be six two five. Yeah, you're right. I think. Something's written on the palm. Five two and a nine. I mean, yeah, it would be six six, six two, two five. five. Yeah. 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 So I'll I'll remember five two nine if you'll remember six two five. Great, let's make this complicated. Yeah. Maybe this key will work on the handcuff. Yes, it worked. We got the arm. Yes. This right arm is a fake. It's strangely cold. It's in a fist too. Oh, does that mean? No, I really don't think it wants to win at rock paper scissors. Oh my god. So we, we put it in the microwave, right? Because it's probably if it's cold, I guess we could so. probably unclench the fingers. Yeah. Oh my god. Ew. Maybe if we heat this up, something will change. What if it explodes? Uh, the hand it opened. Got all warm and soft. Ugh. This whole gimmick is really gross. <laughs> it's really gross. Uh. uh. It's a fake right arm. Heating it caused the hand to open. Did you just play rock, paper, scissors with it, Carlos? What? Like I would do something so childish. Okay, it's open, but now what do we do with it? Do we slap each other with it? Oh, maybe we need it for that thing by the door. That's probably where we put in the code. If we put the correct password in, the code, the door should open. Whatever. Four digits. Okay, let's give it a shot. So do we start with one, two, three, four? And that was wrong. A four digit number. Is there a hint in here? Wait, is the hand supposed to be the number five? So it's five, two, nine, five. Uh, I don't think so. Too bad we don't have that iodine solution Ooh. anymore. Yeah, so we can just soak the hand in it. Left hand plus doll. Oh. So six, oh. two, nine plus one, two, three, four? Yeah. Okay. It's, so... six, it's six, two, five. Not six, two, nine. Right? Oh, it's five, two, nine. Yeah, six, two, five. So six, two, five. So eighteen, 
1859? Sure. Nice. We did it. And then we put the hand on there. Left hand plus doll was the hint for the freezer. Yes, but it only opened the cover. We have another step. Okay, so now we use the arm. Mm -hmm. All right, we were right. This was the hand we needed to authenticate. I wonder what's inside. Let's open the door. It's Junpei. It is a freezer. She's stumbling all around. Is it Junpei's frozen head? I, I don't think this is fake. Now announcing the current casualties. DT, Diana, Five, Sigma, C Team, Junpei. These four are now deceased. As a result. Is locked. So, the one who killed Junpei is Carlos. Oh. oh. Damn it! Damn it! Break, damn you! Ah, <sighs> uh, uh, Connie. Oh, this is what she got the chainsaw for. Yeah. Carlos <laughs> is like, that's hot. <laughs> yeah. Well, now that Junpei's out of the picture. I was wondering if. Oh, that there's was Gab! <laughs> Gab hanging out. Oh, Gab supporting. Gab is tired. Gab is panting. <laughs> Gab is like, I have to pee. Uh, <laughs> Junpei! Why? Why? I just don't know anymore. Damn it. Who would have thought this would happen? All I wanted was to get that $500,000. If only I could save her. Just save Maria. It's all I wanted. And now. What did he syndrome? Ah, for example. Hmm. Say there's a PC with basic low end components. If we played a number of videos all at once on it, what would happen? The processing speed slows down, of course. It's not Dad. much better than if the computer had froze. What's happening with your younger sister is similar. So you're saying this isn't carbon monoxide poisoning, but... Right. With Maria, her brain and nervous system seem to be perfectly fine. We couldn't figure out the cause until now. Other patients with the same symptoms began appearing recently. Reverie syndrome. And they have. Akane Reverie mentioned it. Syndrome. Yeah. Yeah. But she didn't explain it. A variety of moments flicker in and out of the mind, as if one was constantly dreaming. Oh, that sounds terrible. And that's why it's called the daydream or reverie syndrome it is fictional it's all there have been no game. complete recoveries <clears throat> as of yet yeah however it seems with the newest medical technology a few cases have been successful at relieving the symptoms then please you must do the same for her 
Does little Maria have insurance? You do understand what's required for treatment, yes? The doctor sounds so evil. He's got his oh, evil voice if on. If I did, yeah. she'll... Maria will... So that means I... So Carlos really is American. I absolutely can't die here. Cost $500,000. Yeah. That's why you killed Junpei, isn't it? What? What did you say? You figured you needed to kill someone to save your sister. And that's why you... Whoa, what, what are you talking about? Don't play dumb! Did you forget that you and I are the only ones in this ward? So it's obvious oh, the killer yeah, is... Like, I'm out of here. <laughs> Bang. <sighs> it had to have been you, Carlos. Uh. Connie, calm down. I am calm. <sighs> okay, you're right. I'm the only other one here. But I... Was definitely you who killed him. Wait, stop! You say that, but maybe you're the one who really did it. What did you say? You were the one who killed Junpei. And now you're going totally nuts with that chainsaw. I don't believe this. No matter what, even if the world went topsy turvy this very second, I'd. I'm going to be the next one you kill, huh? If two more people die, you can return to your darling little sister. Hey now, if you kill me, your probability of escape gets pretty high. <laughs> what? <laughs> Why'd she run away? Did she feel too threatened by me with this axe? Calmly, think it over again. It's just like any other Code 3. Once 90 minutes are up, an injector in your bracelet will activate. An anesthetic and an agent to erase your memories will be administered. Okay, so after we voted at 1330, we were hit with the anesthetic. We awoke in the pantry after 1800. It's four hours of time not accounted for. What was I doing during that time? Was I really sound asleep then, or...? I just can't remember what happened because of the drugs I was given. Maybe Akane was right, and I... What? Blackout? No, Akane had run off towards control. It might be possible to turn off the lights there. So she did kill Junpei? And she's coming for me. I mean, that's not outside of the character. Yeah. <sighs> what do I do? What the hell should I do? God, what a nightmare. Think calmly, rationally. Who is the most threatening person here right now? Whoever it was who killed Junpei. So what I need to do is remove that person. Even if it ends up being me. No! What the hell am I thinking? There's no way it could be me. So then... Then... Ah! There you are! Damn it. Just who did it? Are we choosing? Akane. You want to put in Akane? I mean, doesn't it seem most likely? Because, like, what motivation does Carlos have to kill Well, what motivation Junpei? does Akane have to kill Junpei? Right. Because, like, obviously, Carlos's motivation is to save his sister. Akane can be pretty cold when she's zero, when she's in control of the game. But uh -huh. she's a subject for this one. Right. But we haven't really heard her story yet. No. Like, we're just now hearing about his sister. I mean, is it... 
Yeah. I don't know. I yeah. just don't. I I feel like it's not Akane or Carlos. I don't remember. Yeah, go for it. Do not know ident. Oh, we have to. Do not know identity. Maybe it's zero the second. Oh. We can't. We can't say zero the second. There's no numbers. Uh, what if we put in? Yeah, but he can't or, dice what about up. Nobody. What if it's not? What if it's not? Well, they said that he was dead though. His ex, his ex pass showed up, so he's dead. Confirmed. Yeah. Right. Uh. I don't know. You want to just put in Akane and see what happens? Yeah. We can always come back to this. Right. I feel like we might get more information from Kami. other scenarios, from other fragments. It's not exactly stealthy, the chainsaw. I told you I didn't. I didn't kill him! Cut off his hand. Oh my god. She's still she's still going. Carlos. Oh, I knew it. You No. I didn't kill. Junpei. I'm sorry. I couldn't avenge you. Akane? Because Carlos also promised them that he'd get them out, apparently. I, yeah. So yeah. does it make sense for him to kill killed. Junpei? Yeah, it's clear that something's going on with Carlos. Like, he's able to... <laughs> he's able to move through time like they are, uh -huh. somehow. Right. Okay, so well... Let's see that flow chart for that one. Yeah, where is that? Okay, it's over here. Okay, who killed Junpei? Right, so that's where it is. It's right there. So if we go... If we go to that... So we made it here. Okay. But there's actually, there's actually a locked thing beyond that cinematic. Interesting. Okay, let's go back to that and let's say... Let's say Carlos. Carlos this time, yeah. Can you say Gab? Did Gab kill Junpei? Let's see. Let's, I think it has a clever little answer. If you if you say gap, I hope so. Because I think I did that when I played through. <laughs> How would a dog do it? Yeah. I'm just glad that they had something. All right, let's say Carlos did it. Even though I don't think he did. Right. I wonder what would happen if you put in other t people's of names. Akane, she'd never do something like that to Junpei. He's very... Yes, he's very important to me. If that's the case, then I'm... I'm the only one who could have killed him. It might have been a demon possessing me. Or maybe it was some kind of parasite. Or I'm under hypnosis? Whatever it was, I'm... Regardless of the reason, I was the... And then I forgot I did it because of the damn amnesia drug. Carlos? Don't come any closer. I'm dangerous. My body moves against my will. I might kill you next. All if right. that's how it is, then... <gasps> Carlos, no! I love when their eyeballs go all crazy like that. So wait, how did he kill himself with that axe? He pressed it against his neck. He just—it's just that sharp, huh? 
I love the. Psh, yeah, <laughs> no! the geyser. Yeah. Everybody hits their aorta every time. Why did this happen? <sighs> Akana, you were gonna chainsaw him in the back. Mom, Dad. Everybody's got a tragic backstory. I won't let anyone die. Carlos! Carlos! I am so sorry! You couldn't have killed Junpei. And, and who did it? I did it! Ah. Wow. <laughs> so what the heck? Yeah, it doesn't make sense a game for over it to there. be Carlos. Ooh. It's weird that the Akane choice has, like, extra scenes. Yeah. Like... Yeah. Here, look at this. It was also this way. Look oh, at this. nice. This I is like a more that. detailed version. Whoa. This looks a little more like VLR, yeah. Okay, yeah, this is definitely way more. So this rolling. is where. Now, interestingly, there's one past this. I don't know how we get to it, though. Like, how do we get to these scenes? Actually, interestingly, this, this one of like who killed Junpei. Carlos's sin. There's a lock there, and then it goes all the way down here. That's wild. So something something that we get from another look look, we did all this last video. That was very that was very good. Look, it's nice and clean. So red means C team, green means D team, and blue means Oh, I wonder sorry, if, sorry, green means D uh, Q team. If this is uh if the reason we can't see any further is because it's the other teams. I I'm not sure because I think I think each team has one of these. I, we'll, we'll, we won't know until we fill it out some more. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um, yeah, I like that they've got two different ones. It's kind of cool. That is kind of cool. But yeah, so these... So yeah, this is a game over for now, and then this is Lock Mines. Like, so we've got we've to like explore another fragment Uh huh. to get through that one. Interesting. Um, okay, well, so what did you think about that scenario that we just did? I kept wondering if that was Junpei or if, like, when they would open up that cabinet, they would find him in there. Right. And he'd be like, you guys took forever. Yeah, he'd be, like, leaning against the wall, all asshole like, and just like, you guys took so long. Were you making out in there? Yeah. Like, oh, my God. Don't lie to me, Connie. Are you making out with him? Yeah. He's going to go super incel. I kept wondering like if Saiyan. it would be him, but, like, if he was the one. But mm. it doesn't make sense for either of them to have killed him because he had like a code written on his hand. His hands were handcuffed. Yeah, how would they how would they have sold it up? That's why it was like it's gotta be zero. Right. That killed him. But I guess we get some sort of information from another fragment. Right. Yeah. Akane Zero, got it. What'd you think about the escape room? That was our first escape room in this game. It was good. It was Pretty uh, easy. Yeah, it wasn't too bad. Yeah. I uh Excuse me. From what I remember, like the the escape rooms in this one are pretty easy. Okay, it's like, not too they're, they're all about that level. Yeah, I don't remember anything in this game that was like, oh, that was a hard puzzle. Or that was a hard room. I feel like so. the last one had several that were like really tough, right? Or was that the first one? I remember. One? I think it was more nine 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 that had tough puzzles. VLR's difficulty was more like navigating the decisions and stuff. Hmm. From what I remember, anyway. Right. I mean, I don't think any of them are really hard. They're, like, a good, challenging level. I just remember, like, one of them had some puzzle that we got really frustrated over. I think it was the Q room, and VLR had, like, a couple of, like, slide puzzles or something uh -huh. that was annoying. Yes. But I don't really remember. We've blocked it. Oh, well. Um, so should we go through another team? I was thinking we could end it there because uh, usually I would think like the escape room episodes, there's not that many of them. There's like six or something like that in the game. Oh, okay. So we've already been through one. 
So um, it won't all be like the decontamination room where we see everyone go through kind of the same scenario. No, that was kind of a unique scenario. That's why I wanted to do that one first. Gotcha. From what I remember anyway. Okay, cool. And from this point on, they're kind of really separated. Like they don't do much more of that like vote to kill each other type of thing. Right. It's just kind of like... Now, interestingly, in that timeline and the one that we just did, uh, D-Team was all dead. Right, like we had initially Diana, decided. Diana, Phi, and Sigma, which the words were red, blue, and milk? Uh, Red, blue, milk, and jump. You know, jump was Junpei's, right? If we were mm-hmm. to... Uh, I don't they know. They didn't show us. They didn't show us who they were associated with, but... Um, okay. Well, cool. Interesting. That was fun. Yeah. All right. Well, uh, that was part three. We'll see you guys in part four. Yay! Bye! Bye!